Hi ho, it's PSU Pun Guy, and today we are doing a follow up to our GE water filler filter installation, the XWFE for our GE uh, bottom freezer, and this is uh, two days later, and you notice the last time we had very little ice in. Uh, the ice cubes are nice, well formed, and there is a lot of them. So, you know, we did have a few that had gray in, which, you know, I would suggest that when you change the filter, you run some water through the door, and if you can clean the ice maker or the ice area out and the first batch may come out with some uh, carbon that is in the filter but you can see the difference that it made it gave us a lot more ice and the water flow in the door is much greater so you know after about a year uh, it is recommended that uh, you do you know change the filter depending on your water you may have to do it much you know like six months instead of a year but uh, we did put it off and we'll go back up uh, the filter status button is you know not blinking as I said you can reset that uh, at least once sometimes twice but you know when you start losing your ice making capability uh, it does make it easier that if you put in a new water filter you'll have ice and water better tasting uh, so just part two of the video give us a like a thumbs up or become a subscriber uh, we're doing these videos for you and Hopefully they help. Uh, we thank you for watching. Have a great day.